What's going on, everyone? Thanks for tuning in. Little Middle Earth for you here today, and this time it is not resealed. <laughs> it is not resealed. So I, um, I actually picked this up off a vendor I used on I use on eBay very frequently. So I, uh, <laughs> I, kn I knew this wasn't going to come in opened or anything. After some rings, we're after some bowmasters. Of course, some serialized cards. Of course, some of the poster cards. Um, you know, just uh, excited to be opening another box of this holiday edition after this uh, after this holiday. So, really, just a, a nice nice looking product. I know I was really negative on it when it first uh, when it first launched. Um, I I, I kind of changed my tune a little bit. You know, I'm I'm pretty happy with what I'm seeing, and uh, I'm I'm going in going in for some more. Now it's a dreary day out here, so I'm not leaving everything on. Um, oh, we got our foils. That's right. I'm not leaving everything on uh, camera wise, just because there's some glares. It's just it's not the greatest day for it. We got the the footman, the white hand. Okay, we got the Searing Light, the King of the Oathbreaker, Baradur, Baradur, and the Tempta. Tempt me with that discovery. Baradur, I'm not, uh, if that's a land to hit, that's a, yeah, yeah, a yucky land to hit, folks. I see a, a kind of a nice, bet you that's like a Gladril. Bet you that's that new Gladril. Reprieve, that's a good hit. Arwen's Gift, a Golem's Bite. We get the Swamp, good old Rangers, Song, Arendil, and the Fell Beast. A big old horn. Oh, Water's Edge. I was wrong, folks. Sam, what do we got in the back? Myriad. Myriad non foil. Man, I was wrong. Now that's a land you want to see. That's what you want to see in the back. Nice water's edge. Um, move that out of the way. Yeah, we'll keep that there. That's one of our nice hits. I think I sold one recently for 47. It took a while to sell it, though, to be honest. I think people were just like, hey, where's the bottom in this thing? Because, you know, that Surge Foil was really a, the big hitter of the last Lord of the Rings set, and they kind of screwed everyone over when they, when they did what they did here. Weaver? Council, there's Galadriel, Light of the Valinor, Born Upon a Wind, Sergi, Elrond, uh, Garbage, okay, Hugh Foil, Hugh Foil, that's a, that's a hit, I don't know, I feel like that, uh, I feel like they're like 15, 20 bucks for that Hugh Foil poster. Bewitching, Gothmog, they're sticking. Because they're so gritty. These cards are so gritty. Brandywine. Swamp. Frodo. The Elves. We got the Chargers. The big old Battle of Bywater. Ugh, Gandalf. Eh, we're Ur Urborg. Okay. Token. Dole Amroth, that's like our, our main hit of this of this uh, video so far. Troll, Celeborn, Gimli, his Furies here. We got the Elrond, Lord of the Rivendell. Swamp, forging that blade to get into the war. Call forth. Sharky, not another, not a pool you want to see there. Okay, we got another land. We got another land and a Harbinger. Redhorn, I mean it's. It ain't a, you know, it ain't a gemstone caverns, but heck, who, who am I to complain? The far sight. These are really gritty. You can hear them. Nazgul coming in. Okay, very nice. I'll take a Nazgul every day of the week. In that slot. Lost Isle. Lost Isle. I don't want it calling me. Dark Fortress, that's another land. Should we just line up all our lands? Palantir Surge. I think this kind of tanked though, to 
be honest. It's not what it used to be. <gasps> no way. No freaking way. You gotta be kidding me. I buy one box of this stuff. I get one box from Rudy. I buy one box over here. Every, every time I pull a, ser a serialized. You're kidding me. Oh my god. Holy god. Wow. That's, that is the serialized you want to see. Jeez, oh man, Gandalf the White. I saw um, the number one of 100 pulled by uh, MTG North. Um, wow, check out the centering. Centering looks pretty solid. Um, wow. Man, you guys are going to watch my Lord of the Rings opening and be like, how the heck is he doing this? How, how am I, do I? I don't even know. Because I got a... Don't forget, I pulled this one. And now I pulled this one. Um, yeah. Wow. I mean, what, what are we here on this? A thousand, two thousand dollars? I I don't even know. I don't even know. I'm like, I can't even open a pack anymore. I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't even, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just like... <laughs> okay. Ooh. Wow. Should I just, like, keep opening Bach of Reprieve Foil until I don't pull a serialized card? Right? Scroll. The Farmer. Oh, quick Reflexes, too. Holy cow. Mithril Coat. That's a nice... Oh, my God. No way. No way. And a Harbinger. Jeez, oh, man. I'm like... Ugh. Wow. Quick Reflexes Surge and Double Tap, same pack. Quick Reflexes Non-Surge. Jeez. Man, this $270 box just turned into... Turned into like two grand over. <laughs> Holy God. Medicine. Uh, trickery. You know, I, I buy from multiple different folks and I buy, you know, across eBay, across all TCG. Um, you guys know Rudy. Um, and I do that because I, I actually want the chance of hitting more because I feel like if you buy cases at a time, you're actually limiting how much your odds. Like, I'm really in for the high risk, high reward on some of this stuff. Um, trap, the Dismissal, Ringo South, I just sold one of these. Charger Surge, okay. I think I actually have that already, but I am collecting those scenes. Um, we're just gonna throw it over there. I don't think it's worth anything. I'm, I just, I'm putting it there because I want the scenes. Okay, Knights, Dunedain, Samwise, Gifts, Willow, Smite. Okay, another Baradur. Warg. We got the Corrupt, Corrupt Man, Frodo, and Pact. Okay, Pact. Couple bucks. Couple bucks for the Pact. Man, this is really giving me a tough time. I, like, forgot how to open a pack. I'm gonna just go retire now. Deceive, troll, another deceive. Mirror, swampy, another sharky. Eagles. A big ol' mace. Watcher, watcher surge. I don't think that's doing a lot. You know, but if you're playing that Kraken, Kraken deck, Gandalf, an attempt. Um... I really would like to see a second harvest for one of my decks with that Bombadil art. I already pulled one, but I'd like one to put in my deck. Cast? It used to be something. Same with Lorien. Lorien revealed prices have tanked. I don't know if you guys have seen that. Flame. Sildur. Call. A couple bucks on that. Okay. Shards. Shards. Why, why do I feel like I haven't pulled this before? 
I, I don't think I've pulled this, folks. I'm gonna have to check this one out after the video. Um, I don't think I've pulled that before. Last pack. What is going on? I'm all over the place, sorry. I just am like shocked. I, I'm still like, I can't believe that just happened. Dunedain and Fear Planes. Okay, here's for the finale. Model, Call for Aid, Resolve, Shagrat, Samwise, and for all the money, Yuki. <laughs> well, we got. <laughs> they just they said, hey. Give him, give him one he can actually play with, and then give him the collector version of it. Um, but yeah, phenomenal pull. I mean, this uh, this box was a hit. I really wanted some uh, some rings and some some other things, but I didn't get it, and that's okay because we got we got a heck of a lineup. School. We got the uh, Red Horn Pass, a little hue, two reflexes, a shards. I'm, I'm sure shards is doing pretty well. I just, I haven't pulled it. I just don't know what the price is. And this Gandalf, the white, that I'll probably hold until eternity. Because um, I love Lord of the Rings stuff in general and having a serialized Gandalf poster card. Oh my God. So thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, check me out on TCG Player if you want to buy some singles. Uh, remember, check out my sorcery videos, and uh, you know there's a lot of them out there. So if you're interested in sorcery, check those out. Thanks again, folks. Talk to y'all later.